Hello, dear friends. May God bless you all in the name of the Lord Jesus. Listen, I have a word, a promise for you here today, right now. Pay attention to this word. Call upon me in the day of trouble. I will deliver you, and you shall glorify me. These are words from God. God inviting those who are afflicted, oppressed, suffering, those who are desperate, to call upon Him. If you have a problem, you have a need, perhaps you've gone to the doctors, you've taken a lot of medication, but your problem still persists. Perhaps you've been doing a psychiatric treatment for a very long time, for many years, but nothing has happened yet. I think the following. I think that when the problem is spiritual, only God can resolve. When the problem is physical, sometimes the doctors can help. But when it's spiritual, only God. There's nobody else. I think this way. The Bible guarantees us help that comes from God. The Bible is full of invitations for us who are afflicted or in need to cry out to Him. And here is a clear and specific invitation from God to you. Call upon me in the day of trouble. I will deliver you and you shall glorify me. Isn't it wonderful? Tell me the truth. You are there perhaps all alone. You've done everything you could. You are alone. You've been abandoned. You have nobody else near you. You have no friends, no family members. You have no one, right? And you are lonely. God is telling you, call upon me in the day of trouble. I will deliver you and you shall glorify me. Meaning, as we receive God's deliverance, then His name is glorified through us. And of course, the Bible says that those who go down to the grave cannot glorify God. But those who come out of the grave can glorify God. So in order for you to indeed, for us to indeed glorify God, it's necessary that a miracle will happen in our lives. There has to be an answer from God to our requests. And this answer comes as we call upon Him with all of our hearts. Dear friend, why don't you do that right now? Why don't you call upon God with all of your heart? You who are suffering, you who are tired of suffering, you who are afflicted and desperate. Why don't you do that right now? There where you are. Because the Bible affirms that the Lord is near to those whose heart is contrite. May God bless you all abundantly and I'll see you tomorrow.